Greetings, Benjamin J. from Ben's Trains with another in the series. Well, a follow-up on that Lionel 8902 that uh, arrived this afternoon. DC locomotive, five bucks on eBay, and uh, the light bulb was burned out, and uh, it took a miniature screw-in bulb. So I would have to order it. It's not available anywhere that I know of. So in any case, I just modified it and put a standard bulb in it, and uh, the way I've got it... Uh, mounted it shouldn't get hot enough to melt the plastic it's basically suspended inside this space anyway i just wanted to do a quick video it has a headlight it has its uh, rectifier installed been reassembled this thing is running just absolutely splendidly so the uh, lionel 8902 dc locomotive running on ac pulling 10 lionel cars so let's take this around and see how it goes Okay, there's 50% power. Nice bright headlight. And like I said, this locomotive is new. It looks like it just came out of the box. Doesn't look like it's ever been run or played with. Anyway, this just reinforces everything I say. You can do this on an absolute shoestring budget by doing things just like this. This $5 locomotive and a $3 rectifier. It doesn't take long before you can uh, have a fairly decent collection of inexpensive locomotives that run absolutely splendidly and look nice. You know, I don't think anybody would object to owning this. And now that it runs on AC, you can drop it on anyone's uh, rail anywhere and it'll run just absolutely splendidly and it looks new. It looks nice, it runs good, it has a good bright headlight, it has lots of pulling power, it has a traction tire, and it was five bucks. Pretty difficult to beat that. That's running just absolutely perfectly. Nice and smooth, nice and quiet. Good constant speed all the way around the rail. Nice bright headlight. So, what more could you ask for? Anyway, it looks nice. The important part, of course, is the fact that it's inexpensive and it's running, pulling uh, 10 Lionel cars. So you can do this on a real shoestring budget. You don't have to spend a lot of money on this. At all. So anyway, just a quick follow-up. This Lionel 8902, as I said, this thing, this, as you can see, it looks new. It doesn't look like it's ever been played with, touched, run, nothing. It's perfect. Anyway, five bucks simply because it was a DC locomotive. And I watched it and watched it, finally put the only bid on it, five dollars. And uh, that was it. I was the only bidder. <coughs> Excuse me. And then that uh, three dollar rectifier and, I don't know, including the headlight, now probably half an hour of my time. So it's really straightforward to do this. It's really simple. And these... Uh, DC locomotives. They were entry-level stuff, but as you see, that's not a bad-looking locomotive at all. It has a front truck, has decent push rods, nice wheels, spokes, in really nice condition. So I don't think anybody would object to owning this. And now that it's running on AC, you can run it anywhere on any uh, layout there is. So really simple to do that. Anyway, just a quick follow-up on this. Don't overlook the junk and don't look, overlook the DC locomotives. I'm actively looking for these things now. They are just absolutely dirt cheap. And uh, with the price of that rectifier, three bucks, you know, I still, I'm still only into this thing, eight dollars, and it's running just absolutely perfectly. So anyway, just wanted to do a quick follow-up. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to drop me an email, benstrains at gmail.com. And as always, thank you for watching.